that makes sense. Yeah. So it won't be animation all the way through, but it would still be a good amount. So, which kind of it just represents the transition from go from seeing something from the naked eye to seeing something with um a more in a more spiritual sense, or maybe the third eye. Mm -hmm. Um, I want to say in a very innocently nerdy way, it's like it's like in Hunter X Hunter when um, before they learned then, um, in which you can see the surrounding aura of the person. Mm. So I'm not saying that's literally how it is, but you know, kind of some sort of like that. It's like transmuting aura creatively. Um, and aesthetically. Um, yeah, no, totally. I like that. In a sense, uh, we have the two eyes, which are myself, the camera, and then the third eye, which is the black plasma. Um, yes. There's like three points of tension there. Um, and I, yeah, I really, 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 I really love this as it is. I really do. Um, I kind of, I mean, I think this is the beginning of something in a sense. Like, uh, I'm just not attached to this being the, um, I, I basically, I, I strongly believe this is the beginning and this is just literally like a first creation. Um, so I'm, I'm just like, um, what's the word? I'm open to the discovery more than the result. Discovering how it's received. Um, discovering what it means for it to be a completed piece um, and then to really really take the time and invest in an idea like for us to for me to think of an idea and then for you to also think of an idea and for us to bring it together like this like kind of combusted naturally which I love as well um, and I think I want to go with that 